There is some really sad news developing out of Las Vegas right now. Henry Ruggs, first round draft pick for the Oakland Raiders, now a member of the Las Vegas Raiders, has been officially charged with DUI resulting in death for his role in a car crash that happened this morning around 3.39 a.m. in Las Vegas at the intersection of South Rainbow Boulevard and South Spring Valley Parkway involving a Chevrolet Corvette, which is reported to be his, and a Toyota RAV4. RAV4. Responding officers located the Toyota on fire. Fire department personnel responded and located a deceased victim inside the Toyota. God. Lee. The preliminary investigation indicates the front of the Chevrolet collided with the rear of the Toyota. The driver of the Chevrolet, identified as 22-year-old Henry Ruggs III, remained on scene and showed signs of impairment. He was transported to UMC Hospital to be treated for non-life-threatening injuries. Ruggs will be charged with DUI resulting in death. This is an ongoing investigation. Ian Rappaport tweeted that out. TMZ reported this a little bit ago. We weren't 100% sure if it was true. I guess it is a Class B felony in Las Vegas and and would um, require imprisonment of at least two to 20 years if found guilty in this. Rest in peace, obviously incredibly sad. Henry Ruggs now is staring down a much different life for making a poor decision of driving while impaired. Incredibly sad, hate to see this, AJ. It was terrible, yeah, I saw some of the rumors floating around, what, 30 minutes, 45 minutes ago uh, about what was going on, so yeah, that's, the most in-depth part of that I've heard of it. I'm sure more will come out, but yeah, what a what an awful situation. For yeah, we had not heard the police report until very recently here. It had just gotten tweeted on the internet. We had an eye on the situation, but much like the DeAndre Swift situation a few months ago, you have no idea what's real and what isn't on the internet. The photo that surfaced of the crash, it was of the Toyota. Obviously, it looked like it had just gone out of fire, I guess, now that they're telling us it was on fire. And then the Corvette in the back, which is Matt Green, that it looks like it is absolutely ruined as well. There was an entire internet game happening during the show on whether or not that was Ruggs's vet or if it was somebody else's vet. There was a design on Ruggs's. I guess we just haven't been able to see it on this photo, but the worst suspicions turn out to be real. Henry Ruggs III was driving that Corvette that inevitably got into a car crash with a Toyota. The Toyota started on fire and now people have passed away. It is incredibly sad. Um, Man, you can't be driving drunk, oh, okay? Nope. Especially now, there's no reason. There's no reason to. There's so many different available options for you to do so. A team in Las Vegas, this was always going to be talked about, right? It was always going to be talked about. A team in Las Vegas, what will it be like? Visiting teams coming in, will they be able to be disciplined enough even if they have a sleeping, um, a... Uh, Curfew? Bingo. There it is. A curfew and everything. Will they still be able to maintain it when the NHL went into Las Vegas? It seemed like the Vegas flu had gotten a lot of the away teams that would come in there. How about the players and the teams that live in Vegas? How would they do that? As somebody who, you know, used to potentially go out a lot, I don't know what it would have been like being a young person in Las Vegas, but I do know that if you're Henry Ruggs and you're a member of the Raiders and a member of the NFL, you can't be driving drunk at 3.39 in the morning. That's just terrible. This is... Obviously could have been avoided. We hope for justice in this entire thing, and hopefully everybody is able to... Ah, somebody passed away out of nowhere. Yeah, terrible. Yeah. Golly. It's scary how quick things can change. Just like that. Think about yeah. it at 3.15 a.m., what was happening in both of those cars, 3.15 a.m. Probably so much fun. Probably so. There's probably music being played or wrapping up, whatever. Maybe they're going to work. Maybe the Toyota's going to work. Who knows? But then all of a sudden, in an instant, everything changes. That's why you have to think about those things when you're making your decisions.